some natural makeup for the daytime, just kind of showing you um, a natural look. And um, I have prepped my skin already with skincare, and um, I will be showing you that in a different video. So um, first, what I'm going to do is I put my sunblock on already. Now I'm just going to put um, some lip balm on. This is Soothing Touch Unscented Lip Balm. It's fantastic. I have chronic dry lips and that stuff is amazing. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use bare, the Bare Minerals, it, the, the color is tan and because I wanna mat, I've got some self tan on and I wanna match it all up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a combination of the tan makeup and the Mineral Fusion, Mineral Fusion Paris Powder Foundation in Olive One. So I, I'm going to start with, this is actually, I usually use the original formula um, in the Bare Minerals, but this is actually the matte formula because in the morning I put so much moisturizers on. I like a glowy look, but I don't like a greasy look. With Bare Minerals, if you've seen the infomercials, they always do the swirl, tap, and buff into the skin. Well, I'm not going to do the buff. I'm going to do the swirl and tap. But the buffing, I think, might remove some of my sunblock, which I don't want to do. So I'm going to tap it into my skin. So I'm going to just be doing this on the outsides of my face, okay? And I'm going to go down on my neck. And on my nose, under my nose, and I'm gonna avoid. I'm gonna avoid the inner parts, which I'm gonna use a lighter color on. So I'm I'm just gonna use the same brush. I'm gonna use the same brush, brush which is like an old elf brush I use. That's fine. It works fine for me. Um, but I'm gonna use it, all the olive one. Now I'll tell you something about Mineral Fusion. This is this is a good foundation. The, the packaging is is not good because the top was plastic and it fell out, and it's not it's not real cheap. So I wasn't real happy about that. But the makeup is pretty good. The make the powder foundation is nice. So um, I'm gonna go over my eyes and here. Now I'm gonna go here where I have wrinkles here because I wanna brighten up that area and I don't want the tan color there as much. I wanna lighten up that tan color a little bit. Go over my eyebrows. ahead and use a little bit of the Mineral Fusion um, Concealer Duo in Warm. The lighter color in the corners. There's two colors here to blend into the right color so you don't look like you have raccoon eyes. So I'm going to use a little bit of lighter color on my lid. I always use concealer on my lid. It's not what I've always done. I don't use primer and it works fine. No need to spend extra money on things that don't work as well. I'm going to put a little bit on my eyebrows and put a little bit more of the powder that's left over over here. Next I'm going to be using my favorite product ever and it is the Mineral Veil from um, Bare Minerals. I love this. It makes the skin look gorgeous. So again, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna swirl and tap, but I'm not gonna buff, I'm gonna pat it into my skin. Everywhere, over my eyes, everywhere. It's just what I do. So I've got a little pimple <laughs> on my forehead in case you didn't notice. <laughs> so I'm just gonna use a little bit of the darker color first and a little bit of the lighter color on top of it. Press it in. I did lance it and pop it, but it's still big. <laughs> so I'm gonna do my eyebrows first, because I think it kind of sets the tone for the face. And 
this is the Mineral Fusion in medium brown um, pencil. And I'm going to use the Milk. Milk cut, uh, is a clean line. You can get it at Sephora. And um, this is a, uh, a really good brow, um, a brow pencil. And it's a little darker. All right, I'm going to use my uh, Gabriel eyeshadow in the color Bone. This is a great color. It's just kind of a little bit vanilla. I want to say a little bit of vanilla. Perfect base color. I usually only use two colors of eyeshadow. I just make my life easy that way. I mean, I used to go into all this routine with my eyeshadows and I think it just looks better as I've gotten older just to keep it very simple. So I also have a Gabriel. Um, this is the classic eyeshadow and I'm just gonna use this bottom color. It's just like a neutral color. Raise up my eyebrows to make it easier to apply. Let's go back and forth. I'm just going to use an old library card to blend the eye, the eyeshadow. So the eyes are pretty much done. Next is eyeliner. Eyes are almost done. Next is eyeliner. And I'm going to use this um, Zuzu. It's called, it's the Gabriel. It's from Gabriel brand and Zuzu, which is a clean, uh, pure line indigo and in indigo. Indigo is like a dark, like a dark purplish color. And I'm going to stay real close to my lash line. I like the way that the, the purpley colors make my, bring out the greens and yellows in my eyes. I get on purple eyeliner kicks here and there. And I've been on one lately. I just love the way it looks. So I'm just going to do it on top today. I'm going to use my Mineral Fusion uh, bronzer. Um, and there are two colors, and the one on top is the lightest. I'm just gonna use it on top of my cheekbones. Actually use my card so that I don't get it messed up. I tend to get things transferred to my cheeks, top of my forehead. And I'm gonna use a darker color too on top of that. Blend it really well. Kind of like a halo. My I'm going to use my milk blush in the color work. This color work works really well on top of bronzer. And I might put a little bit here. This is the CoverGirl Lash Blast Mascara. It's a very clean formula, black brown. This is nice. This mascara goes on so well. It stays on, it doesn't clump, and it's under $10. So this will be the one I'll be buying from now on, I think. And I like to go under my lashes and on top and definitely on the bottom. So I have my, my Zuzu pencil in the color Innocence. 
and um, my lip pencil. I'm just going to do um, a warm natural lip look. I'm just going to um, put a little bit of powder and I usually like to start by going up. And I go a little bit above the lip line, not too much. I'm just going to fill in a little. For the lipstick, I'm going to use two colors. I just um, used, I just bought this Honest Beauty. It's a liquid lipstick. It's a long wearing. I bought it in two shades. Happiness and the color of this one's Off Duty. I'm going to use the Off Duty, but I'm going to use the Burt's Bees Sunset Cruise first. And I love this lipstick. It's so nice. It, it's, it's so creamy. I'm going to apply it and then I blot and blot. And then I'm going to use the Honest over it. And then I'm just going to apply a little bit more bronzer um, under my nose and on the sides just to finish up. Blend it in a little more. And honestly, this is a little bit more makeup than I wear during the day. So thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Tell me about your makeup routine this summer if you have any new bronzers because I'm looking for some new bronzers to try. I would love to hear from you. Please leave a comment below. Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you have a great day. Bye-bye.